It's a great day to be a Spartan. A South Waco Spartan. I want to welcome everyone to this memorable occasion. Today, we celebrate the milestone of the start of the renovation and expansion of our school. We appreciate all of you coming out here today to share this special day with us. Of course, this day would not have come to fruition if not for the hard work, endless hours, and true dedication of Dr. Kincannon, her team, and the Board of Trustees. For several weeks, we have watched out the windows and heard the melodic sounds of the jackhammers <laughs> and other equipment as work has gotten underway to make for the future of South Waco. In fact, one afternoon I had a teacher, Ms. Crocker, she texted me and said that one of her students says, it feels like an earthquake. <laughs> and so to bring some laughter to the situation, I responded with, hey, not every fourth grader gets to experience an earthquake in Texas. This is an exciting time for our staff and students and our community. Our students and teachers deserve a school that reflects the pride and dedication they show every day. It's amazing to think that a year from now, there will be a new and expanded school in this very spot that will be better to serve our young, le uh, young le learners and our high school students with the Future Educators Academy. We are thankful to the community for investing in our students and teachers and for recognizing that expanding and renovating this special neighborhood school is important to us. It reflects the promising talent and bright futures of our South Waco Elementary Spartans who are already shining. Here to perform to us today is South Waco Elementary students directed by Ms. Stephanie Munoz as they sing the selection, Shine, Shine, Shine. terrific performance from our students. Let's give them another round of applause. Good job, good job. You definitely do shine. I loved a little bee bopping with it too. It was really cute. Thank you so much, Miss Munoz. I am Waco Independent School Board, Stephanie Cordawag, and I am so happy to be here today along with my fellow board members. We have Vice President, uh, Trustee Jose Vidania. Uh, board Secretary Jeremy Davis and uh, Jonathan Grant. The district is doing outstanding work and our students and staff are reaping the benefits. We're making huge strides in academic achievement, attendance, athletics, fine arts, and just about every program we offer as I've been sitting in the uh, 
trustee dais i've been watching data across the district in every level from elementary through high school it's like a bar graph and every every year it's making one step and it no um no particular area is being left behind so that is huge so give yourselves a round of applause for that but there's always more to be done and this administration does not shy away from putting in the hard work to move our district forward. Dr. Kincannon and her team took on a massive undertaking in the long, long range facilities planning process. And I know our community is grateful. Their leadership resulted in an initial plan and ultimately a successful $355 million bond that made it possible for a new GW Carver Middle School Waco High School, Tennyson Middle School, Kendrick Elementary, and extensive additions and renovations to South Waco Elementary. This is a huge accomplishment, and I am grateful for her dedication. Today, we're coming together in celebration of a next big step in bringing that bond plan to life with construction un underway on our fourth of five campuses and our first elementary project. South Wake is the first. Okay, we would not be here today if it was not for the extraordinary community support we have received and the incredible support our neighborhood schools like South Waco have in our city. From the bottom of my heart, I want to thank you for supporting the 2021 bond and the additions and renovations we celebrate for South Waco Elementary today. We as a board will continue to always do our best to honor your commitment to the students, staff, and families of Waco ISD. Now, please join me as I welcome our Waco ISD Superintendent of Schools, Dr. Susan King Cannon. Good morning. I'm not even sure I needed to follow those students or uh, Mrs. Frazier. Didn't they do such a great job? Really proud of them. Yeah, you can clap. <laughs> also, I want to welcome uh, Mr. Jim Patton, uh, trustee. Thank you for coming as well this morning. Um, it is great to be here to celebrate the construction of new additions and renovations that have already begun on this site right here behind me at South Waco Elementary. And in just 18 months, um, just in time for the start of the 25-26 school year, if you can, can you guys believe that? 25-26 is coming fast. The space will be transformed into a beautiful new 27,500 square foot classroom addition with a library and um, administration section just right here behind me. And then on the opposite side of the campus, also growing um, to include a greatly needed full-size gymnasium. Where's the PE teacher? Is she out here? There she is. She's been after me since I got to Waco about her gymnasium. So you're gonna get your gymnasium. <laughs> Um, it's, uh, it re gymnasiums are really important to elementary schools and um, you know back in the day we didn't build them um, and so a, a modern elementary school just comes with a gymnasium so we're excited about getting to do that and by the time we finish all of the work here um, with the additions and then the extensive renovations we're renovating about 64,000 square feet of building um, this important neighborhood school is going to be transformed, as you can see in the pictures there, um, into a modern, a modern school with engaged learning spaces um, that meet the needs of today's kids. And we're excited about that. Um, certainly excited, uh, we're excited, but I'm excited mostly for the kids and the staff. I wanna thank you all for coming out this morning. Appreciate you being here. And I'm so glad that you could be here today to celebrate. I loved having you, seeing you, watching you look at all of the diagrams there. We do have some special guests here today, um, and I want to uh, thank them for joining us and taking the time to celebrate with us. Um, and also want to thank everyone who's made this possible. So um, I know we have um, some members of our district's Long Range Citizens Planning Committee here. We also have some current, our current board, thank you for coming and um, also our architectural firm from O'Connell Robertson. Um, we have Pooja Harris 
where's Pooja? Right here. Thank you. Pooja's working on this pro has been working on this project. We appreciate your work. And Nick Patterson, an engineer with O'Connell Robertson. Thank you, Nick, for coming out today. I think you've done every groundbreaking with me, Nick. Yeah. I know. I noticed. And then, of course, um, the guys that are making it happen, the Masonic construction team, Mr. Ed Masonic is president here. Um, he's got his hard hat on. Thank you. <laughs> he's ready to work. Um, and he, his team members are Mark Masonic, vice president, Eddie Masonic, project manager. I think they're out in the field working. Um, Aaron Miner, project manager, and John Kazanis, project manager, and Thomas McLaughlin is the superintendent of this project here every day on the job. You're probably really the one making it happen. Thank you for your work. I also want to thank our chief of facilities, Gloria Barrera, and her team. Here's Gloria. Right in front of me. Thank you. Um, for managing on behalf of Waco ISD and on behalf of the board, who um, are the owners of this project, the oversight of the project, and for working um, diligently to keep the project within budget so that we could honor our commitment to our taxpayers. That's a big thing. And finally, I just want to say that a school is only as strong as the community that supports it. And that's why we're excited today to welcome one of our community partners, Bur Burlington Stores, who has a, pre uh, a special presentation for us. So please come join me. Thank you. Okay. Hi guys, good morning. My name is Larissa and I am the store manager for our new store opening in Waco later this month. Burlington continues to be a proud member of this community. We're committed to the community and its residents, which is demonstrated by many of our charitable initiatives, including our partnership with the national nonprofit organization Adopt a Classroom. With that being said, on behalf of Burlington and in celebration of our new store relocating in the neighborhood, it brings me great pleasure to share with you that we are providing a $5,000 Adopt a Classroom organization donation to your school. We hope this <laughs> we hope this donation helps empower your students to build brighter futures. Thank you again, and we look forward to seeing you at our new store when it opens Friday, February 23rd. Thank you so much, Burlington Stores, for your generous donation and ensuring that our classrooms are fully supplied to meet both student and staff needs. We look forward to visiting the new store at the ribbon cutting later this month. Thank you to everyone that came today. Please join us for lunch, courtesy of Masonic Construction and our cafeteria, as we celebrate this milestone together. Thank you again for coming. <laughs>